This video may not be appropriate for children of 13 and under. Parental discretion is advised. Hi everyone, my name is Raziel Kane. I'm back with another video and today I'm doing a bit of this because I received these for this guy. And this is a contender for figure of the year. I don't know if he's going to be the uh, number two, three, four. Uh, I'm not sure yet, uh, but uh, this is a great retool of blur. Uh, the best use of that mold. Uh, you can not barely tell that it's you know a blur base i guess but this guy is amazing and since he's the only mainline defcon we ever had and probably will ever get i'm super happy to have this guy in my collection and he was a mainline figure i that's a figure i fully expected to be an exclusive generation select something but no mainline figure so everybody's happy i love that thing and then uh, with these decals you know all that shiny foil backing um they, they it looks really good i'm excited and uh but we'll see uh, how he turns out but before we do that i just want to remind everyone to check out djc collectibles my sponsor fantastic online store and at the end of this video you can get your 10 percent discount code for anything transformers and also check out my interview playlist or more my voice acting playlist the main feature of my channel something i'm very proud of uh you can learn about the actors or hear it you know some of them came on the channel so you can um, hear about their experiences. It's pretty cool. And now let's roll the intro. my home planet of Cybertron millions of years ago during the Great War. Okay, and here we are before I apply the decals. And you know, the decals are really just a treat. Uh, because it's not like uh, this is going to make him more uh, toy accurate, because there never was a toy. Uh, but you know, uh, you have a, a small uh, smoke screen display here. But the coolest thing is that you have S. Lizardo. That, to me, it's worth everything. And, I don't know, something says cat pack extra, extra large. I don't understand that reference, but it looks uh, it looks a good set. It looks good, and I like it. Uh, nice colors. And then this guy, since there was no toy version um, from the G1 era, uh, it's, it's going to be just enhancement, um, you know, shinier color. Uh, yeah, I'm, uh, I'm excited, but he looks already really good. I mean, superb head sculpt. Uh, that's, you know, with the, uh, you know, a bit uh, scourgy, uh, but that looks really good. Uh, the Orbot logo, silver highlights, nice abdomen here with the red and silver. Um, they could have painted that silver too, but they went with just the standard light gray. Um, you know, it fits with the shiny, shiny red here. I wish they had painted the, the toes to match. That would have been nice. Uh, the gun, painted, um, silver, looks really good. Uh, the same paint on the fins or uh, the arms that we have here. And then you have the accessories, I always leave them in the back in robot mode. Uh, you know, the uh, rockets, and uh, painted again, and not, well, yeah, no, they are hollow if you uh, look from this angle. But yeah, overall, it's a really solid figure, and the transformation is fantastic, love this guy. All right, so final look at uh, DEFCON. Uh, so there you go, final look at Legacy DEFCON before he goes to the Cybertronian paint shop. It's probably, I don't know, who does that on Cybertron? Who would, oh, Trax. It has to be Trax. What is this creature mumbling about? All right, he's back from uh, the workshop. A uh, couple of leftovers, uh, mostly uh, duplicates. A uh, little red stuff here, and then these ones here, and an extra of these which, uh, well, you'll see where they go. Uh, extra eyes, and this was uh, just a little enhancement. So overall used pretty much everything, uh, even the optionals um, I did put. So yeah, I like when I use uh, the whole thing. And this guy now looks even more amazing than he was. Uh, nothing like little eye decals, and they were hard to put in there. So that's, uh, you know, not my favorite, but it works. Uh, you have sh uh, pin covers, like l you cover everything. Um, so you have an enhancement around here, plus a little red one uh, for the shoulder. 
you have a little smoke screen that's optional because you have two of those red ones that you can use but i chose to you know give uh, more homage to the episode so that's pretty cool uh autobot logo which you replace with an enhancement uh that's one of the optional little blue line all around silver highlights here uh nothing for the the abs you do have two little lights here uh, a new crotch decal and um, you know on the sides and then for the foot you have those little uh, where I showed you the, there was uh, still duplicates and you have uh, this thing here uh, for the uh, the toe and with the light open it might help a little more uh, you have these things here on the side uh, this was tricky to apply because um, it really didn't show well where to put it on the on the, the, the you know the website uh, but uh, you know if you take a closer look you figure it out uh, so red enhancement here this one there was no indication where to put it so be careful when you uh, actually uh, you know before you throw away your sheet make sure that uh, you found everything um, what else oh it's Lazardo in the back I was expecting him to be more like on the vehicle mode but and the image that Toy Hacks had like that cat pack XX large Lazardo and with the RC Lifeline and Elita 1 like all gushing over it I don't understand that reference but anyway you have two little decals here uh, you have behind the shoulder the same type of decals that uh, we saw uh, in front like all around the, uh, the the thing you have pin covers and a little red enhancement uh, you have pin covers like if you unhook this you have a major pin cover here, which they don't really have to include because you don't really see it ever. And then you have four pin covers uh, over here. You have uh, pin covers on the interior of the leg right here. So yeah, no, I like when there's enough uh, pin covers to cover everything. So that's, I know I'm probably missing some. Oh yeah, there's uh, under the uh, arm guard or uh, I mean the uh, it's a wing or a fin or whatever when he's in the alt mode. And uh, what else? No, that's pretty much, well, a little here, but that's more for the... Uh, oh, yeah, okay, uh, so, hmm. That's going to show more in alt mode, but you do have three red decals on uh, the, uh, the arm like that. So, pretty sweet. No, I'm uh, really happy with this. Like, this is just all new original stuff, right? Like, it, it's not stuff that we saw on... Uh, on the show, uh, on the show, uh, the uh, they were pretty much uh, plain, uh, so I guess it's just easier to draw a, a character repeatedly when he, there's not uh, many details to it. So, anyway, I like this guy. I really like the way he looks. But uh, let's take a look at uh, the alt mode. Lizardo, I invite you to join me as my partner. And in vehicle mode, he's cartoon accurate. It's fantastic. Love the colors on this guy. Looks good. I mean, you can see the arms just, you know, plugging in on the side and that's pretty much it. But he looks the part. He looks good. Uh, just a bit of hollowness here, but the paint is really nice. The details are already good with the red and the silver uh, on blue. It, you know, and the little gun. And then you can add the gun on top here. And then you have the thrusters in the back. Oh yeah, I can't wait. I want to see the whole thing with Slizardo. So, well, let's go send him to the paint shop. <laughs> and here we are in alt mode. This is already one of my favorite alt modes uh, because it's a flying, you know, space car. Uh, well, it would not maybe a car because it was capable of interstellar travel, but uh, really cool and I do like what they did with the decal set one thing you have to be careful this decal here and the same one on the other uh, there's no indication where to put it so you have to you know find it um, and this is what I mean they show you those decals what I you know when I mentioned that they they're hard to find that's because they show where to put it in alt mode and in alt mode you really don't see them that much uh, so you have uh, you know that translates from robot you have the shoulders uh, little red uh, dot here and then you can see some of the you know crotch uh, decals uh, still there but you get new decals right here uh, it looks pretty good the back end gets four decals here and then two kind of tail lights 
Uh, you do have two enhancements on the propeller. Uh, you can still see smoke screen here, so you know they can talk uh, all the way in the uh, alt mode. You have uh, those uh, little uh, decals uh, here, uh, a new one that mimics the crotch uh, decal, uh, and then you have a little red dot here, the Autobot logo. That's optional. I chose to put it, and then you have one, two, three decals to do a uh, I don't know more stylized uh, nose, and then you have uh, this one here, and. I know I'm missing something, I always, oh yeah, uh, all the way on the side, you have that red line all the way here, uh, very easy to uh, install, so, and then you have this here, that translate from uh, the leg, mm, and nothing underneath, well, you do have the uh, this one here that shows up, and that's, uh, well, those are the three little red decals that I talked about, oh yeah, you have those one here uh, on top uh, for the fin. Or is that landing gear? I don't know. Pretty much it. Oh. Well, oh, god damn it. I put this one on the other side. Ah, uh, well. I'm gonna have to try to fix that. It should go here. Oh, well. Live and learn. So, thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed this uh, review. I really enjoyed uh, applying this set. It was very uh, fun. And it really works. Uh, the fact that there was no template to go back to. Toy Hacks just used their imagination and nailed it. So I hope you've enjoyed this, if you did please like, subscribe and hit the bell, also leave a comment, love reading those, keep coming back, I have more on the way, and remember, nothing in life gives you the right to be an asshole. Take care. There you go, fixed it.